It is whispered that in a distant solar system, there is a racing league named Zero Tolerance Racing League. No human was ever allowed to enter their races. I wonder why. Hey guys, Gamer here, and I am playing this game called Quantum Rush. Now, what this game is, is... Now, just to clarify, this is a closed beta game. Like, this is a closed beta of Quantum Rush, and... Basically, how I've been able to get this, I was actually invited into this, so... Yeah, it's pretty awesome that I actually get invited to actually test out a game and company's game. So, this is by Game Art Studio, and... I'm not sure too much on what to expect, so... Anyway, I think this is kind of just research stuff. Racer, that's just to look at stuff. High scores. Sweet. Now, there's two thing, two other things I want to clarify while I'm doing this test. One, there's no audio throughout this entire thing. There's no game in audio. And the reason behind that is that, well, if you can see my mouse cruiser right here... It's black, which means I'm doing this on a Mac OS X. Now, of course, since this is a, this is a Windows uh, program, I'm actually running this through a program called Wine. So, yeah, that's how I've been able to run it. Okay, waiting for players. So, let's see if I can get any players here. Since this is a closed beta test and I am running this on a Mac OS X, then you're going to expect a lot of bugs during this, so just keep that in mind. Hello. Crap, there's nobody to race with. This is what happens when you actually do the closed beta test two days after you get it. So, <laughs> great. Okay, so I'm just going to do a little bit of a practice here. Just so I can actually, you know, do some stuff until I wait for other people to come online. Or if they even come online. Yeah, because when I was doing the test from before, like, I had a few problems actually getting this thing to work. And while well, there were actually quite a decent amount of people online, but since I'm doing this two days after the closed beta thing started... Yeah, there's not too many people online, unfortunately. Oh, and a second thing is that these loading screens go on forever. So, yeah, expect that if you're a part of the closed beta test. I mean, chances are they might actually make the loading screens go short in the full version. But I guess that's kind of... To, you kind of have to expect that when the full version comes out. I kind of wonder how long this game is actually going to last in terms of, like, you know, how long it's going to stay on the air and such. I mean, it, this game does have actually a cool concept and such. And in terms of controls, it's pretty difficult to actually, you know, um, figure it all out. I mean, it's not complicated or anything, but, oh, jeez, Jesus Christ, it's lagging. But, yeah, pretty much, um, you got the, uh... The W to move forward, um, I think S is like to boost or something. Yeah, S is to boost. Um, D is to turn uh, right, A to turn left. Um, and then E to kind of just lean this way and Q to lean this way, which was a bad idea. And then you press the space bar to actually shoot at other opponents because, you know, obviously the best kind of games are the ones where you actually kill other people. Ah, oh, man, I wish I had audio on this, because this looks freaking awesome. <laughs> I mean, once the full release comes out, it should be actually quite interesting. But, seriously, I think this should actually also be released on uh, Mac OS X, since there are people like me that actually don't have, um, like, a Windows. And even the one that is in my house um, is actually for business and not really for, you know, my game and stuff, so... Yeah, I mean, I tried getting, like, you know, parallels or crossover for this Mac, but unfortunately, they've always been ending up, you know, a pain to set up and all that, so I kind of just depend on whatever I can get on the Mac. So, yeah, if we were racing with other people and such, I would be trying to get ahead of them, and I would be trying to kill them. Okay, so I think there's only, like, two laps uh, in this... Um, in this practice so let's try to get to the end as quick as we can so 
Yeah, I mean, there's definitely good potential for this game and all that. I mean, I wish I could actually have, like, you know, other people to race with online at this current moment. I mean, I might actually record another session, hopefully around the time where there are people on are online and such, but right now there isn't anybody online at the moment. Ah, Dane, I wanted to go up on the wall again. Yeah, I kind of wonder if you can actually, like, fly yourself off the course and maybe land on a cl the, the crowd or something. But so far, you know, this game is actually designed in a way where you can really only hit walls. You know, I kind of wonder, in this future, is it like, you know, actual humans inside the machines actually getting killed when they're racing in this thing? <laughs> So I just shoot random people and just go, sorry, it's just, I need to win these games. You know, money is more important than your life. <laughs> yeah. The future can be cruel sometimes. I mean, if we think that, you know, throwing people in gladiators is a cruel thing to do, why not just have people kill each other in races and such? And I'm pretty sure there's been uh, plenty of um, games or whatever that has done that before and such i mean this is nothing really that new but it is still pretty unique i mean just because something has been done before doesn't mean you know it shouldn't be done again just as long as they can add something new to it and since i haven't played every racing game in like you know the world or anything then i don't really know and crap i oh i thought it froze on me thanks to the their powerful boosters the Nitroid racing um, racers are the fastest. This manufacturer even circumve circumvents uh, the safety heat lockdown to get an extra boost. Uh, technology information I'm not going to understand. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Try in three and four hours if you want to do multiplayer. Most people are probably still asleep. Three to four hours. So that would be like uh, one or two o'clock. Okay, thank you, guy. Um, I'm just going to do this and then just wait. Okay, so um, I'll be back in a second. I'm just going to wait for another three to four hours or something, and hopefully there should be some people online. So see you guys uh, later. <laughs> Hey guys, Nitza back, and um, so I have uh, seven other people to race again, so this is pretty awesome. So the minimum uh, apparently is four, so yeah, so about 14 hours has passed, and um, of course, around the time that the person was saying three to four hours, that would have been like 1 p or 1 a.m. or 2 a.m. in the morning, at least in my time, which means, you know, I have to actually balance the time where... You know, there are people in, like, the UK or something, or people in Germany, or... You know, I have to balance it where most of the people will be online, so... Yeah, this is going to be pretty exciting. Let's race against other people. Laser weapons do the same damage against shields and armor. That's good to know. Ah, crap, cords are tangled here. Yeah, the loading screens do take a long time, especially when you're doing this whole multiplayer thing. I guess you gotta be able to tolerate with, you know, other people's internets while also making sure that this whole entire thing can flow online. And since, as I said before, I am running this through a Mac OS... T what the heck? Okay, something went wrong. Um, let me try again. Um, okay, Death Race. Um, okay, I'll race with these people and... I'll do airport. I haven't done airport yet, so I don't know what to expect. Um, I mean, I've only done the canyon, so it's either the canyon or the airport. Like, there's three different stages we can do this on, and apparently the, uh, I don't know, one of the uh, sunset one, I don't know, it's like a beach one, uh, is only used for racing, whereas um, the airport is used for the um, shooting or the canyon. Alright, there we go. So now we're going to be racing against four other people. So, we'll see how this goes. After a long-ass loading screen.
Okay, apparently there's check marks on um, the four other players and not me. So there's something wrong or something. And it could be because I am running this through a Mac OS X and I'm running this through a program mimicking a, a Windows program. So yeah, chances are I can't. I probably can't do the multiplayer. Great, this is the second time I've been brought to the menu screen, so which means I don't think I'm going to be able to race at all. Which is stupid. So yeah, I guess we can look at the other stuff. So right here we can look at our Ion Energy 1 and then the Nano 1. So here's our Nano 1. Um buy racer slot um, another nano one uh, machine such a beauty yeah I think I'm gonna stick with the ion energy one I don't know it just looks cooler yeah it sucks I can't do the m multiplayer for some reason so let's look in the research. So in the research, apparently we get um, uh, okay. Skip the researches. Uh, current research projects. Um, so I'm guessing this is basically just information on, on maybe uh, getting some of this um, stuff. So here are the ion energy ones. So let's look at um, what looks cool. Ion energy five. Um, Oh geez, this is a lot. No, 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 this is a lot to remember. I don't think I'm gonna have enough time to actually remember all this. All right, I'm gonna try it a third time, and if it doesn't work, then yeah, it, I guess I'm gonna have to stop this session. I don't think I'll be able to do the multiplayer because of my um, because of the problem at hand. Oh, wait, 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 I just got checkmarked. Ah, oh, awesome, okay, now I can do the multiplayer. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Three, through, one, and go. Okay, obviously these guys have probably played more than me, so I'm gonna suck, and it's lagging a lot, God damn it. Okay, this is an embarrassment. What the frick? Oh, God damn it! I can't even see what's going on. What the heck? Okay, there we go. Now I got something moving, except now I'm far behind. God damn it. Oh, this is an embarrassment. Yeah, the whole thing is lagging. I mean, it wasn't like this in the practice. Oh, what the frick? Yeah, so I think it's official, guys. I don't think I'm going to be able to do the multiplayer, even with, um, you know, being able to access it and such. I mean... I mean, if I'm hitting walls and such, and if it's lagging like this, there's no way I'm going to be winning these races for sure. Come on. Okay, this is BS. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Uh, I guess this happens. And I can't pause it for any reason, so... Yeah, I'm pretty much stuck. Crap, I exploded. Great. I can't even move. I guess the creators found out that I was being such a noob that they don't want me to play anymore. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I can't even pause it. I can't even move. I can... Hold A to do this, hold D to do this, but I'm just stationary like that for some reason. So, I don't know, um, I don't know, uh, I don't think I'll be able to do the multiplayer, unfortunately. I hope they don't have to wait for me in order to finish the race, because that's not gonna happen. Okay, it stopped, so let's see what happened. Alright, um... 
Okay, so we're back to the main menu, and I'm gonna try speed race instead of death race. Although something tells me that people prefer the death race over the speed race because apparently violence is more dominant than, you know, just natural racing. Indeed. I'm gonna try one more time, and if it fails, then I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna stop playing for now. Alright, I got accepted, so... Five of us, let's go. I take the center! And... Oh, what the heck? Hello? Go? Can I go? No, I can't? Damn it, this is just like the guy who couldn't start in the pod racing from Star Wars 1. Great. I thought there was really going to be no difference between those races, but apparently they're similar at the moment. <laughs> uh, come on. Why can't I move? This is BS. What the heck? Uh, apparently one of the races just passed. I mean, I can look in the rear view, but for the most part, I can't do a damn thing. What the frick? What the frick? Whoa! Did I just kill one of the racers? I don't know if I just did that, or I don't know. Okay, guys, so that was Quantum Rush. Now, I don't know. There's problems with me getting the multiplayer to work, and I don't think it's because, you know, there's any problems with it. It's for the fact that I can't really get it to work because of the... Um, I, it, it's mostly because I'm running this on the Mac OS X and such, you know, through Wine and such being able to actually somehow present a um, Windows program through a Mac and such. I mean, I don't think it's really, you know, their fault or anything that this is not working or anything. I mean, I'm pretty sure, you know, some people have come across any bugs, but I'm pretty sure this is not a natural bug. I'm pretty sure it has to do with the fact that I'm running this on a different operating system rather than Windows. So, yeah, take the practice for what it's worth and... Yeah, this game definitely does have potential, and even though I haven't really got a taste of the multiplayer, it still looks pretty good. So, guys, that was Snitza Gamer with Quantum Rush. Um, if I can get this multiplayer thing to work again, then I will definitely do another session on it. So, guys, that was Quantum Rush. See you later. I got out. Goodbye.